dear students and viewers good morning welcome to our online class of shakipur pilot girls high school dear students i am arman khan assistant teacher in english shakipur pilot girls high school dear students do you know what is volunteer okay volunteer is a person who offers to work freely for others or who take part in an enterprise or to take part to a undertake a task okay today we shall know about a young volunteer named pop who visited sundarpur high school today our topic is Paul visits Sundarpur High School. Unit eight, lesson three. Unit eight, lesson three. Paul visits. Sundarpur, Sundar. Can you remember? Why is Sundarpur? Sundarpur is a place where Kavita lives. In the previous class, I discussed about the places. In Unit A, Lesson Two, about Kavita's place. What was the name of the place? Was Shundar. Here, Paul is a young volunteer who visits Shundar High School, and he works in an NGO in Bangladesh. Do you know the abbreviation of NGO? N G O. We will find here some new words. New words. N G O. Non government. Organization, non-government organization. Greeting, past participle form of greet that means help or give a. Light or sign of welcome to a person. This is. We can find here also poison. Poison. Name. Inflammation. Inflammation, which administer of poison to a person or animal, either deliberately or accidentally. Poisoning, fight. Five means struggle. I think these are the new words, dear students. Now, open your textbook, page number eighty-eight, unit eight, lesson three. 
part B. Listen to me what I am saying carefully. Paul is a young volunteer of an international NGO in Bangladesh. NGO means non-government organization. He visits Sundarpur to talk to the villagers about arsenic poisoning. What do you mean by arsenic? We have heard arsenic for a long time and many times, but we don't know about its main definition. Okay. Arsenic means the chemical elements of atomic number 3, a bright or steel grey metalloid. It's very poisonous. Read the message to know about his visit. Okay, thus we are going to know about Paul visits to Sundarpur High School. Listen to me. Paul went to Sundarpur High School to meet the teachers and students there. He was warmly greeted by Paul. Here he was greeted warmly. He quite enjoyed the green coconut drink that was served on his arrival. Arrival means coming. He gave a short lecture to the students and explained how they would fight against arsenic poison. Paul also answered the questions asked by some students. He liked most of the questions. He also took some pictures with the students. He always takes his camera with him because he loves photography. As he was taking leave, all the students followed him up to the school gate. The teachers wanted to hire a rickshaw for him. He does not like riding rickshaws. He does not like riding rickshaws. But Bangladesh is full of rickshaws. In fact, he hates the idea of sitting idle while another person is pulling the rickshaw. So he did not mind walking towards the local union council office. What have you understood from this thesis? We have learnt that Paul is not in Bangladeshi. He is a foreigner and a young volunteer. Now, we can make some short questions from this thesis such as Short questions. Number one. Who went to? Number two, how was Paul greeted by Paul? How was Paul greeted by Paul? Number three, what 
did fall explain explain means interpret explain to the students to the students number 4 why does fall always keep camera with Last one. What did the teacher did the teachers want to do? Or or you can also see many other short questions from these passages, and you can also see in part C in five questions here are has been created. Okay, who went to Sundarpur High School? Paul went to Sundarpur High School. How was Paul greeted by Paul? Paul was greeted warmly by Paul. What did Paul explain to the students? Paul explained about arsenic poisoning to the students. Why does Paul always take camera with him? Paul always takes camera with him because he loves photography. Last one. What did the teachers want to do for Paul? The teachers wanted to hire a rickshaw for Paul. Are you clear about these questions and its answer? Okay. Try to write the answers of the questions in part C in your textbook, and there is also is another homework for you. It's a completing story. In the previous class, I have given you a completing story named Unity is History. Just the title. Today's completing story is Homer. Completing story. Just I am writing. Try to understand. Completing. Nobody. Believe a lie. Okay, thank you, everybody, and be careful about coronavirus. Thanks, everybody.